loves, it's Sam. So today I'm gonna be doing, now they decide to fight. They've literally been quiet this whole time. Shush it, will you? Look at them. He's up there. She's on the floor trying to get him. It's a mess. Um, okay, so today we have a very exciting box. So you guys know if you've been watching us for a long time on our vlog channel that I have been friends with Judy from It's Judy's Life and It's Judy Time for, gosh, um, the kids were super little, so years, over five years. I love her so much. We did Dan Simber with them numerous times. We went and stayed at their house. Judy is one of those people that's just really humble. And even through all of her successes, she's, she's stayed very down to earth and kind and genuine. And she's just a really sweet person. I feel like sometimes with YouTubers, when they grow and they get super successful, they forget about the small people along the way that they were once friends with. And Judy has never done that. She has always been so kind to me and every time she has a collection launch or a new product she always sends me out one which is super duper sweet and she stays in touch with me and I just really appreciate that because not a, not everybody does that I was so excited when Judy asked if she could send me her new collection from the JMK collection so she just launched it it's actually launched I'm so sorry but I need to go and lock my pets out of here because they're driving me insane Okay, I got Tittles out, so hopefully she'll relax now. I have got, she's jumping up on my, <laughs> this dog, I'm telling you. Okay, why don't you just go sit on the bed and relax? Relax, calm down, don't eat that, don't want that. So Judy reached out to me and asked if she could send me her collection and I was so excited. She didn't tell me what it was. It was just one of those things that she said, I have a new launch and I'm, I want to send it out to you. And I was like, oh, what's it going to be? Is it going to be makeup? Because she has makeup bags that I love. She's come out with makeup in the past. Um, so I had no clue what it was going to be. So I was so excited when I saw her um, announce it on her Instagram because I love robes. I'm such a loungewear PJ comfortable and I love robes because I love wearing them when I get ready in the morning and so um, I was so excited when she came out with robes and her Style and her design is absolutely beautiful. So I'm going to show you the box that it came in because the box was so Gorgeous she did such a good job. I'm just so proud of her. I'm just so happy for people when nice people succeed It just makes me so happy. So I love the box. She did a beautiful job with the design. So it says treat yourself JMK I'm assuming it stands for the initials of her children because they are JMK. So now Tittles is scratching on my door I'm never gonna get this video done today There's a cute little hummingbird on the top which I do have a connection with hummingbirds anyway So I love the fact that she featured a little hummingbird on there. There's really gorgeous little flowers And then when you open it up it's just such a pretty box. It says the jmk.com right there. It's so pretty inside. So it's got a gorgeous picture of Judy. Look how pretty she is. She's so lovely. And it says, I wanted you to be one of the first to hear about the launch of JMK. The JMK collection will be officially available online February 2nd on the jmk.com. Till then, I hope you take the time to treat yourself and enjoy wearing these robes. Can't wait to see how they look on you. Um, again, it's got little flowers on the inside. And it came packaged really beautifully. And I will leave all of the links down below um, so that you guys can go ahead and get one for yourself or follow her on Instagram. Um, and then there was a sweet little card, again, with the exact same um, design as the box. So it has that gorgeous hummingbird and the treat yourself in like a gold foil. And then it just says, Sam, two years in the making and they're finally here. I hope you enjoy wearing the... JMK robes made with love. Slip on, relax, and treat yourself. Love, Judy. So that was really sweet. She's calmed down finally. She's a wild one, this dog. Oh, wait a minute. There's some other little goodies in here. Oh, cute. Okay, well, I'll show the robes first, but I think it's like a whole little goodie box of like relaxation. Um, okay, so we have a black one. So this comes in a little bag, which I really love the fact that like you have a little bag if you are gonna be traveling. Oh, it's so soft. Feels really nice. Oh, it's super sheer. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Perfect for Valentine's Day. Looking all sexy for your man or your wan woman. Your wanin. Um, I was gonna say wife and woman and then it just kind of went weird. So this one has really gorgeous flowers and it's kind of like an embroidered patch. And I think that's on both sides. Yeah, 
So both sides have the embroidery. Um, it is sheer and then the little sleeves have like this satin kind of trim around the front part, the sleeves, not the bottom. And then the actual tie. Oh, I love this. Okay, this is so smart right here. She has actually got it attached to the back. So there's no slipping and losing. This is what happens. So my kids always steal the strings, like the ties out of my robes and they use them to play horsey and they tie them up around things and ha like hang their monkeys. It, it's mainly Lily. Um, but then I always lose my ties to my robes. So it's super annoying. So I love the fact that this is actually tied in so that you cannot lose it. And then I feel like that keeps it completely even on both sides. So that's really thoughtful. We have the cream one, which I'm very excited about because it looked so pretty on Judy and I cannot wait. Again, it does come in this little cream bag that says treat yourself, which is very cute. And I think as a mom, we're so awful. I know I am about taking the time to do something for ourselves. I like that kind of catchphrase, treat yourself, because we do have to remember ourselves. It's really hard to, but you do have to remember that you're still a human being, and there are still things that you need to do to make sure that your mental health is okay, and you're not just like completely stretching yourself so thin to try to take care of everyone else that you forget about what you need and what, you know, who you are and that kind of stuff. And I think especially in the beginning of motherhood that definitely does happen where you kind of just forget who you are you forget your place in the world and you just kind of you just absorb every single ounce of energy you have into your kids and as you get older I feel like you do kind of get to that point where you're like you know what I need to I need to just take a minute for myself because I'm gonna go crazy if I don't I know for sure I do especially this last year I really did start to Kind of like change my mind frame and be like you know what it's okay to relax at the end of the night you don't always have to be working you don't always have to um you know if you're sitting down on the couch and watching a show i used to feel like that was like i was guilty like i felt guilty for doing that and now i'm like you know what no you work your butt off all day long you wake up super early with your kids you are constantly you know busy and working and you hardly take the time for yourself it's okay to sit down at the end of the night at nine o'clock and watch love island and just binge that's no that's not a problem that's not something you should feel guilty about but i used to be in that mindset where like i felt like i could never just sit down and relax and like do something that like wasn't um what is the word? I can't think of the word, but like, I always feel like I should be doing laundry. Like I have something to do. Like I should be doing laundry. I should be cleaning right now. I should be organizing. I should be working. I should be editing. I should be emailing. I should be whatever I should be doing. And it's like, I was in that mindset where I felt like if I was just sitting down relaxing and doing something that like, just, I wasn't doing anything productive, that that was bad. And I should feel guilty about that. And so the last year i really just tried to like stop thinking that way and just be like you know what you deserve to rest you work your butt off like it's okay to watch a show and just enjoy it and not be doing something productive okay so this next one is kind of like a creamy pink almost or like a super soft pinky peach cream but it has hummingbirds on it and it's so beautiful so there's hummingbirds and leaves and flowers and it's absolutely gorgeous. Like look how pretty that hummingbird is. The design of this is super beautiful. And now this one's a longer one. So it comes down long in the back and then a little bit shorter in the front. Um, and it's again, oh, okay. So this one isn't attached. So, oh no, it is, it still is, yay. Okay, wait, hold on, is it? Okay, so yes, it is still attached on the back middle so that you aren't going to lose it. So I think that's really thoughtful. I'm so glad that she's done that because that is just seriously um, so genius. I wish all of my robes did that. Oh, and this one has pockets as well. How exciting. Okay, so I'm so excited to try those on. So I have a medium large. Okay, and then there's some other little goodies in the box. So I'm just going to open those real quick and then we will try everything on. The first little goodie, and this is not stuff that she sells. I believe this is probably just a PR, like little relax, treat yourself kind of thing. Um, so it's a sea salt and lavender soy candle. Uh, looks like this. Smell it. Oh, I love the smell of sea salt in a candle. I think it's just like kind of creamy or something, you know? 
that one smells really good it smells exactly like sea salt and lavender so i'm very excited to burn that then we have the jayco co jayco co arabica espresso in 60 percent dark chocolate so one bar equals one serving to one in need then we have the beet plus vitamin a fresh pressed sheet mask from sweet chef and then we have the ginger plus vitamin c fresh pressed sheet mask how cute is this the packaging is adorable of these i love this i love the fact that she literally made it a full-on like experience i love that she's given the chocolate the candle the sheet mask that girl knows exactly that's exactly how i would relax and then we have the j coco bali or bali sea salt toffee and milk chocolate okay so i'm gonna eat this one <laughs> And then I'm gonna give the dark chocolate to Jay because I don't actually care for dark chocolate So that's so sweet that she's done milk and dark just in case you don't like the dark So this one the blue one is called the after hours robe So I'm assuming this one is kind of more like nighttime a little bit sexy because it's um, see-through and this one is $69 so the sizing, they have extra small, small, medium, large, and then extra large slash XXL. Then we have the sunrise robe. And the sunrise robe is $79. So a little bit more expensive, but it's kind of got, you know, a little bit more material. It's longer in the back. So those are the prices. Um, I will link both of them down below for you guys to go ahead and check out. And I will leave her channel as well as her Instagram accounts for her personal Instagram. And then, of course, the JMK collection as well. So you guys can go and follow along. And, um, yeah, if you guys have ordered one, let me know if you guys decide to order one. So now let's go ahead and try on these robes. I think I'm going to try on the white one or the creamy. It's kind of like a creamy, peachy, pinky but more cream, if that makes sense. But it's not just a straight cream. It's got a little bit of a tint of like a, it's just a warmth, if that makes sense. Let's go ahead and try these on. I'm so excited, ah! Okay, so this is so cute, you guys. And again, this is in the medium large. Um, so I just have a little, whoops, I just stepped on it. Okay, so it's a bit long. Um, I just have some little pajama pants on and a tank top. And this is what it looks like open. So it's so cute. I love the sleeves. They're super big. They have those hummingbirds on them. It's so beautiful. Um, and it just like lays really nicely. Also, this neckline lies really nicely. I have a couple of robes and they kind of like bunch up weirdly around my neck. And this one seems to fit so well. Look how beautiful that, that lies. It's like a really nice thick band right here. So it lies down really nicely. And then it does have a bit of a curve which comes in so I think you can wrap it a little bit better. Um, and then of course it is a little shorter in the front. I'm just gonna stay on my tippy toes because it is a bit long, but I am 5'2", so <sighs> might have even shrunk, who knows. So yeah, it does come down like on the floor for me just because I am so short, but it is absolutely beautiful from every angle. Okay, so that's what the back looks like. So you can see it is quite long on me. Dang these short legs. Next life, guys. Next life, I'm gonna be tall. I'm gonna be tan naturally. It's gonna be great. It's gorgeous. It's such a pretty design. So now I'll tie it up and maybe that will bring up the length a little bit. Okay, so that's what it looks like tied up. So you can see it has come up quite a bit so that now it's not on the floor anymore when I'm standing. It's just above the floor. And it's so cute, it's really flattering. It ties up really nicely. I love the fact that, again, it is attached in the back so these strings are gonna stay even. Look how cute that is. Oh my gosh, it's actually really pretty with these pants and the little white tank top. This is so cute. I feel really pretty and very kind of, um, like very feminine and delicate, but still sexy. Like it's really, it's really cute. Makes me feel very like, rich <laughs> i don't know i just love it it's gorgeous i think there's been a lot of thought put into it especially with like the way that this you know this um the tie is actually sewn in the material is lovely it's absolutely gorgeous it has a lot of really pretty um like the design is really pretty the, the actual shape of it's pretty it's really beautiful i mean i think a lot of time and effort and the quality is very nice. I think it's worth it. It's really beautiful. And one of, the, you know, robes are one of those things that you wear so often that it's okay if you spend a little bit more money on something that you're gonna wear over and over and over again. You know, usually you have like maybe one or two robes that you alternate, so when one is in the wash, you can use your other one. I feel like it's one of those things that I think it, you're gonna get your $79 worth out of it if you do decide to buy it. So, absolutely love it. 
It's beautiful. I feel romantic. That's what I feel like. I feel like the notebook. Okay, so now we are moving on to this one. So this one's really lightweight. It is obviously sheer. So it's something that you could wear over like some cute lingerie if you're trying to be a sexual being. Um, or you can just wear it over pajamas like I have and it's still really beautiful. I think the length is actually really gorgeous and it looks really pretty open. Um, I love this embroidery right here. I think this is absolutely gorgeous. Look how pretty that is doesn't want to focus for some reason what's going on here there we go isn't that so beautiful and I love the fact that it has this little satin strip like the trim and it, again it lays really nicely on the shoulders the sleeves are the perfect length I love them it feels super nice the materials really soft um, it's just really cute especially if it's a little warmer sometimes those thicker ones can get a little hot so I think this would be great if you do live somewhere where it does get a bit hot in the summer and it's you're, you're a little sweaty getting ready this would be nice because it's very breathable and it feels very sheer and like lightweight um yeah i feel really cute in this this is very sexy to me i think this is absolutely gorgeous let me go ahead and tie it up for you do you see right here whoops where did i, I just lost it where is it gone okay so it's, it does have the little strings right here that you can just tie to kind of bring it in so that it stays and then Hold on a minute, I can't tie. I can't see because my boobs are in the way. And then you just close it up. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh, I love it. Where is this? Oh, I forgot the ties all the way in the back. Oh, there it is. Okay, here we go. We're doing it. Okay, no, I got it. Okay, we're just going to pull that over. Oh, it's so pretty. I love it. Look how cute that is, you guys. I absolutely love it. It's so pretty. I think both of the designs are gorgeous. I don't know if I can pick which one I like better because they're both very different. Like, the white one is very kind of daytime, like very romantic. I could see very bridal. Like, that would be such a beautiful bridal wedding or um, a bridal dressing gown, robe, whatever you want to call it. Whereas this one I feel like is a little bit more nighttime appropriate. You can still wear it in the day, of course, but it's kind of like a little bit sexier. But the other one is also very romantic, so I feel like either way, you're going to look like a hottie matati. This is such a pretty little Valentine's Day gift. Oh my goodness. I feel like if you're looking for a good gift that you want to ask for your um, Valentine's Day gift from your hubby, I would love to receive this if I got this in a cute little box with some pretty bows. I think this would be absolutely beautiful um, to receive as a gift. It's one of those things that you can wear like to be sexy with lingerie underneath. It's also really nice to just wear over some cute little PJs like what I'm wearing right now and it looks really pretty. Okay just guys, so there you guys go. I hope you guys enjoy and found that helpful. Definitely check out the JMK collection. I love it. I think she did such a beautiful job. Congratulations to Judy and of course Benji and the whole fam. I'm so proud of you. I'm so excited for you. I'm so appreciative that you um, included me in your PR package list. I mean, I'm so, I love it. I'm so excited and I absolutely love robes anyway, but I love them even more when they are designed by my friends. So thank you to Judy and Benji for this lovely box and for my sweet little treats as well. My little relaxation pack. So I'm super excited for that. Um, I would highly recommend these robes, you guys. I think they are very, very nice quality. They're worth the price. They're going to be something that's going to last you a long time. And I just feel like you can wear them numerous ways. You can be sexy. You can kind of do a little lingerie type thing. You can just wear them as a, um, a little robe getting ready in the morning over your pajamas or like putting a cute little like slip nighty underneath and still being like covered but still really cute I mean I just think they're so beautiful and I do usually in the morning wear um, a dressing gown that's what I usually call them is a dressing gown that's just what my mom used to call them she used to actually have one from Japan because my dad used to do business in Japan so he'd always go over there they were so beautiful my mom used to wear them all the time I wish I still had them I'm so bummed because they were so pretty I always remember when she was getting ready in the morning or you know getting us sorted out for school that she would always have her dressing gowns on and she had numerous different ones but she used to have this black one with like those birds the white ones with the really long they're like super long i don't know what they're called herring no. anyway you guys know what i'm talking about um and it had all these pretty little flowers and like it was so pretty but 
that's why I like dressing gowns. It just it reminds me of like watching my mom getting dressed in them and I always thought she was so glamorous. Um, so I really like wearing them and they're just so comfortable and silky soft on the skin. So yay for Judy. Definitely check these out, you guys. I will link them down below. I'll link all of her information down below, her Instagram, her channel, um, the actual Instagram for JMK collection, since obviously that's different. I'll just leave it all down below so you guys can go and check it out. And if you haven't already subscribed to It's Judy's Life, please do so. They're such a sweet family. She has another baby on the way. So she has three girls at the moment. Two of them are twins. Um, and they seem like they have such funny little personalities. Um, and then they have, I don't know if, they, if they've announced what they're having for the fourth. Um, but they just recently announced that they were pregnant. So... Very, very fun. They have lots of exciting things coming upon their channel, I'm sure. So definitely be sure to subscribe if you love subscribing to families and, you know, new babies and that kind of stuff. You guys will love their channel and they're super sweet. They're so fun. I just absolutely love them and they have such kind hearts. Be sure to subscribe to them. Um, be sure to subscribe to me if you haven't already. Definitely check out the collection. It's gorgeous and I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. I'll see you guys very soon. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this collection. Leave a comment down below which one you would be purchasing out of the two. I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you. Bye. Okay, you know I have to try a piece of chocolate real quick. Shall we? Shall we do it? I'm supposed to be being good. Monday through Friday, I'm really good. I'm a good girl. And then on the week... Oh, these chocolates are cute. Um, on the weekends, I'm a bit naughty. I feel like I have to be, though. I can't be great every single day. I mean, that's too hard. You gotta live a little, man. YOLO. Look how cute. They have, like, the little old-fashioned black and white pictures on them. I'm gonna eat the kids. Um, I just want to have a bite and see if it's yum. <laughs> I have to have something to look forward to at the end of the weekend or at the end of the week. Okay, I'm gonna try. Mm. Mm hmm. Oh, it's got all these little chunks of cho of um, toffee in it. Is that a crunch? That one's really good. It's really creamy, really milky. I said I was gonna have one bite. <laughs> I love chocolate so much. Okay. I'm done.